Hi there, and welcome to Lambda U. My name is Darren, and I'm a Solutions and Support Scientist at Lycor. In this section, we will discuss the science and best practices behind gel equilibration and preparing to transfer for Western blots. Running the proteins on a gel separated them by molecular weight, but now they're stuck in the gel. By transferring them to a membrane, they will be more accessible to antibodies during the immunodetection steps. Following the gel run, we can prepare for the transfer step. A successful Western blot depends on efficient transfer of your proteins from gel to membrane while maintaining resolution and retention of your proteins. Resolution means crisp banding or being able to distinguish one band from the next. Retention means that your proteins are maintained on the membrane throughout subsequent steps. After running the gel, the first step is to equilibrate the gel in transfer buffer. Gel equilibration is a commonly overlooked step. In this step, we will prepare the gel for assembly in the transfer stack. I know we're all in a big hurry, but taking the time to prepare the gel made a big difference in the success and quality of my Western blots when I was in the lab. Failing to equilibrate the gel in transfer buffer can negatively impact the transfer of proteins from gel to membrane. Without this step, the gel can shrink during the transfer, which ultimately leads to blurry bands. Moreover, excess salts carried over from the gel can cause artifacts during transfer due to overheating of the transfer buffer. A defining step of the Western blot is when proteins are transferred from gel to membrane. Protein transfer occurs while immersed in transfer buffer. Placing the gel in transfer buffer, which typically contains about 20% methanol, will cause shrinking of the gel. By equilibrating the gel in transfer buffer prior to assembly, any changes in dimensions will occur prior to blotting. Additionally, equilibrating the gel dilutes out any excess salts that can cause issues when the current is applied. Gel equilibration is a quick and easy step, but make sure to not forget it. Gel equilibration and dimensional stability can be achieved by soaking your gel in transfer buffer for about five minutes when using transfer buffers with methanol concentrations of 10 to 20%. When high molecular weight proteins are being transferred and you're using lower concentrations of methanol, longer equilibration times may be required. Now that our gel is ready for transfer, it's time to choose the appropriate membrane to use. We'll talk more about that in the next lesson.